And well then, you know, he might have to dip into the transfer market. He doesn't like changing the squad. He is Brazilian, although he's been capped by Italy. And as you can see, Trap is back in goal for PSG for this one. And Cavani, big number nine from Uruguay, will start up front. Lots of substitutes for these games. Uh, it's uh, pretty much take your pick when it comes to substitutions in these games. Pastore and Guedes, either side of Cavani in attack. And Alves there in his usual position uh, right back. Kevin Trapp, the uh, German. Just one international cap, but he's a, a talented goalkeeper as well. There's the uh, Tottenham starting 11. And a few less familiar names, as we were saying. And I think it would take me till half time to name all those substitutes, Pat. <laughs> there's certainly a lot of them there. And like you say, he, he's picked a, a young enough team, but the central core of it is still fairly strong. Lloris, Vertonghen, Dembele, Dyer, Eriksen, and even Jan Janssen to a point. Hardy yeah. Kane obviously would start normally, but strong down the middle. He's gone for a little bit of youth in the wide areas and fullback areas, which would be interesting to see. Referee, Ted Uncle, gets us. Krasawa. <laughs> Good ball by Krasawa to Rabio and a chance here for Paris Saint-Germain. Cavani in the centre and it's 1-0. Flag stays down, goal counts and Paris Saint-Germain lead after just five and a half minutes. And it's that man, Edison Cavani. Rabio with the break and a clinical finish from the Uruguayan. Yeah, it's a good finish. Rabio, like you said, did really be well because he held the play, held the ball for a time that he's going to play it into Cavani's path. Here you see a great little play at the back. Nice and confident in their own 18 yard box. Pop it around, get it out wide. I think it's, it's, it's the other centre half. It's Carton Vickers. Dives in a little bit there, gets caught out. And here's here, right? He just waits and waits. Great way to pass, and he's not going to miss from there, Cavani. No chance for Loris. Cavani from nine yards out. Stroking it home for his first goal of the season. His strike rate last season was extraordinary in 36 league matches. Could be at times to just drop off and let them have possession. Let's see what they can do with this one now. Great forward the shot from this end. Oh, what a goal! And what an equaliser for Tottenham. Out of nothing. An absolute doozy. Oh, well, some strike from Ericsson. I just spoke about him saying he is a quality player for him. I love watching him last year, I thought. I thought he was player of the year, to be honest, in the league, and I was different class. And here you see, I'm not sure that this takes a little deflection on its way in, but again, good build up play from Totten. Keep the ball, start it sloppy. But here you see Ericsson just stepping in, looking forward, and it's a fantastic oh. strike. And there's no stopping that. See it here. I don't think it did. I think it just looped up and over the keeper, maybe caught the underside of the crossbar on its way in. You see it here. Fantastic strike from Ericsson. Yeah, just hits the underneath of the crossbar, and a brilliant goal. That was worth the admission money alone. What a strike from Christian Eriksen. Back to Lo Celso. His ball to Cavani is a peach. Maurice doing just enough, but still there for PSG. And it's over the bar from Pastore. Chance. Yeah, it was a chance. Lloris did really well. Red one for in truth to Cavani. Here's he takes on his chest. Keepers out, gets a hand to it. Doesn't go too far. It's a decent chance, two or three Tottenham players and a goalkeeper between, you know, him and his uh, goalkeeper. Oh, and it's gone into the net! What a calamity for PSG! We were talking, Pat, about how casual both teams have been actually at times at the back. That is just... We've seen a brilliant goal from Tottenham and now we've seen a, an absolute joke of a goal, but they'll take them all. Well, I've well, said earlier on, Trap, they, they obviously have real confidence in him because everything is passed back to him. Normally there, he's under pressure, you just put your boot through here, you see it pass back.